What is up guys, it's Kesmir, and I am back with The Walking Dead. Um, yeah, we're on the last episode of uh, the Michonne edition. Um, so we're doing what we deserve. Um, a little disclaimer, my cat Rupert, he's been pretty feisty this morning. I don't know, he's been fighting with the cables on my desk and stuff, and he's been coming and going. Because I've been ed editing some videos this morning, so we'll see if he wants to jump in here a little later. Speaking of jumping in, let's jump back into our little playthrough here. I find the two little girls, like, really flipping creepy. Like... This has been, like, the creepiest thing out of everything. Out of all 70-ish episodes that I've played through, it's like those two little girls are just... Oh, two weeks earlier on the boat. They creep me out about the most out of the whole thing that we've played so far. you're not thinking about jumping because if you do I'm gonna have to come in after you I'm not looking forward to that water's gonna be an ice bath no one wants to see that oak yeah I know Ooh, freezing my ass off here coffee will warm you up one. <coughs> God damn, Oak. You can't call it coffee when more than half's whiskey. Yeah. Uh, you sound like my ex-wife. She was more of a rum girl. Hey, City. Did you hear the one about the kittens who took over the boat? What? Oh, no. Birdo, no. <laughs> he was a mule. <laughs> wow. Gojo, just stop it now, okay? I'm warning you. <laughs> Damn. I despised a lot of them when I first got on board, but they grow on you. Like mold, they are. Gross. Nah, nah, sorry, that shit is now. We're just a crew. Our friends, our family. That's how it started for me, too. Give it time. Before I joined up with Pete, my brother and I were cooped up in an old canning factory. Food for ages. A lot of fat and happy people. But then, a young girl got taken. We followed a trail. It wasn't hard with all the blood. Ended up cornering the people who took her in this warehouse. All ten of us went in. Only I came out. You did the right thing. And it got my brother killed. The right thing can kiss my ass. A few weeks later, I came across Pete, ways up the coast. He saw that look on my face and he offered me a job. Didn't ask any questions, didn't turn me away, just welcomed me in. Pete's a good goddamn egg in a rotten world. I don't always get Pete, but I'm glad people like him still exist. I'll drink to that. I think Berto's little routine is winding down so we can finally play cards. Care to join us? It'd be nice to have you there. Besides, none of us can remember the rules. So, it'd be the most uh, unique game of Go Fish you've ever played. Heck yeah. Yeah. Do me in. Sounds like a challenge. You might regret it when I win that machete of yours. I love go fish. Are you 
sure you want to do this? I need to see him. I need to see that bastard's face. <laughs> Or is she going to kill him now? Well, hey there, Michonne. Sam, I knew you couldn't stay away. Don't fucking talk to me. <laughs> Sam, stop! Easy, all right? The heck Jesus. do you think you stole well, from them? Please, I need a hand! Hey, uh, let go of me! Thank you. Well, why did you stop me? Because you brought it on yourself, you idiot. What are you... Why are you protecting him? We can trade him for our safety. But not if he's beaten any worse than he is. Safety? <laughs> that ship has sailed and sunk, ladies. <laughs> What's funny here is you think me and my sister are the bad ones. But you're the one who burned down our home. Forced our people on the shore to be easy pickings for the walkers. Families, kids, never did shit to you. Didn't stop to think about all the lives you were screwing up. All the shit they had to leave behind. Ignore him, Michonne. Probably burned beyond recognition now. I saw what you did to the people on the mob, Jack. You murdered all those children. So don't lecture me. Get your facts straight, Michonne. Those folks came after us first. That's not what it looked like. You're done talking. You're the one who should be dead. Go Sam, away. calm down. My dad isn't even in the fucking ground yet, and you want me to calm down? I, I didn't mean he ruined everything. He killed... I know, I know. I don't know. Wait. You hear that? Answer me. Now. Still not happy with how that radio conversation went. Michonne, you don't want to keep me waiting. I'm right here. Good. You might be sitting pretty thinking you have the upper hand, but your luck has changed. Michonne and Sadiq. They got the rest of the crew too. Oak and Berto. Look, whatever this bitch asks, don't... Sadiq! Don't worry. They're all in good hands here. But them staying that way is up to you. So listen closely. I'm willing to trade my brother for your friends. But anything you do to Randall, I will do to them. Do you understand? Look, you don't owe me anything, but please, we have to get them back. That's my deal, Michonne. That goes both ways. Anything you do to my friends, I'll do to Randall. You better not touch him! We'll be there by sunrise. Be ready for us. Shit. Bum, bum, bum. <laughs> so, what do you think's gonna happen next? <laughs> what we deserve. <laughs> what? There's something on my face. The bruises aren't so bad. Right? I'm pretty sure she'll notice the fingers. Shut up! Maybe it won't matter. This has to work. Norma's not gonna be happy when she sees them like this. Then we don't let her see him. How long do you think we can keep that up? 
I don't know. I've never done this before. The minute you hand him over, she's going to take that bag off his head. What then? <laughs> you all have no idea what you're in for. Ugh. He's right. Norma's not going to leave us alone. She won't stop just because we gave her her brother back. Sure, you kept him alive, but we still burned all their shit. So we run. After you trade for your friends, we haul ass to the back gate and get the hell out of here. But she'd take the house. Let her have it. Wouldn't she expect us to run? So what? She knows where we are now. Hiding isn't an option. So let's just go. Where do you propose we go? I don't know. Does it matter? Anywhere would be better than here. I can't fucking listen to this. What? Sam, where are you going? I'll watch him. It's Sam Chick, she's so hot headed. Sam. Like she has all the right answers. Yet honestly, it sounds like her and her brother brought it all on themselves. Uh. 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 Sam, stop! Uh. Uh. You're gonna hurt yourself! Uh. 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 God damn it! Uh. Sam, stop! Maybe you're all ready to walk away, but I'm not just going to leave him like this. <laughs> we couldn't give my mom a real funeral. My dad and I had to bury her here. Just the two of us. He'd want to be with her. <laughs> That's all I can give him. I understand. He should be buried with your mom. But we can't focus on that right now. We have to be ready to leave. I'm not going. What? Uh, Sam, you can't still be thinking. My that. mom is here, Paige. Everything I have of her. And Greg, if you want to leave, go ahead. But I'm not coming with you. Okay, bye. She buy the rest of his time. She created the mess. <laughs> Sorry, but I, I can't go. This house meant everything to my dad. It's all I have left. I won't force you to leave. If you want to stay, that's up to you. You don't have to leave either. We can defend this house. We can fight them off. Yeah. No matter what happens, thank you. I owe you my life. Sorry it took me so long to say it. Whatever. I know it's stupid, but I have to finish this. I've got some weapons stashed in my room. Old duffel bag. Should look familiar. You should make sure everyone's armed before Norma gets here. Yeah. Yeah, it's the junk you stole. just wanted to know what it felt like. I, I wasn't going to shoot it. Just... And? How does it feel? It's, it's heavy. Hey. 
Empty. Can I help? I want to do something. Sure, go ahead. Those slide in there. Round side forward. How could they just die like that? Greg and Dad. I, I thought we were safe here. What am I supposed to do? You have to be smart. That's how you survive. My dad was the smartest guy I knew. That didn't save him. The guy who did it killed my dad. He's gotta, I mean, the things he said, the way he was laughing about dad, he can't get away with it. We have to give Randall back to his sister, James. I heard you guys talking. There's more people coming to the house. Sam's hurt. If, if she, they can't hurt her too. You have to stop them. Your sister's tough. I wouldn't worry about her too much. Here. I, I don't know if I'm ready, you know, to have one. Don't forget what I told you. Play it smart and you'll be fine. Norma's on her way. Things could go wrong in a hurry. Wish it didn't always come to this. I wasn't putting the crew first. I didn't insist on looking. If I didn't turn us around and lead us here, none of this would have happened. It's not your fault, Pete. You didn't know this would happen. Oak knew. I should have fucking listened. You'd think after all this time, after everything we've had to do to survive, people would want to help each other. But no. They're just guarding what's theirs and taking out whoever gets in their way. I don't know why I even bother trying to help anymore. Doesn't... Doesn't seem worth it. Maybe I was just fooling myself. I wanted to think there were people worth helping. And now we all have to pay the price for it. This isn't you, Pete. You help people. You helped me. Don't give up. I won't. We just... We have to get my crew back. Hopefully my boat is still in one piece. Shit. What the hell are we gonna do? If Norma's coming for a fight, are we really prepared for that? These kids, they aren't up for this. Sounds like Paige wants to run. Not the worst idea. I'm not leaving without my guys, but once we get them back... Yeah, I'm in. I'm not sure... I think we're gonna have to fight them. I don't. Here, Pete. I don't know. Thanks. I'm fine, Michonne. Just make sure everyone else is ready when Norma comes. James and Alex. Wonder how they'll get through all this. Old record player. Right behind you. Walker. Romers, switching off. Not gonna be able to look at that the same way again. Hello, 
look, see that matchless host march along in the Lord they boast for Pharaoh's army got drowned in. Oh, Mary, don't you weep. Oh, Mary, don't you weep, don't you weep. Oh, Mary, don't you weep, don't you weep. For Pharaoh's army got drowned in. Oh, Mary, don't you weep. Who are the people who look so grand? They must be headed for the promised land. For Pharaoh's army got drowned in. Oh, Mary, don't you weep. They are so happy, just hear them sing. They must be looking for the coming king. For Pharaoh's army got drowned in. Oh, Mary, don't you weep. Oh, Mary, don't you weep, don't you weep. Oh, Mary, don't you weep. Don't Okay. Look, we're done. Oh, oh. What's this? Oh. Yep, we made a mess. I'm a guest in this house. Where are your manners? You know, my hands hurt a little bit. You got any ointment lying around? <laughs> <coughs> yeah, well, when Norma gets here, she'll bust down that little gate of yours and tune you up good. Just march on in. Majestic as fuck. You can still call her off. Get her to let my friends go. I'd rather eat shit out of a dead dog's ass. <laughs> Yum. Don't be a stranger. I don't know. Hopefully we don't have like a timer or something. Just kind of exploring at this point. Daily empty. This must be how they reinforce the gate. Hope it keeps Norma out. What a mess. Could have been a lot worse. Worked better than I thought. Looks like they were ready for anything. Almost anything. Mm. All right, guys. I think we're going to approach Sam, <clears throat> but we're going to end this episode here, and then when we start the next one tomorrow, we will approach her then. So, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Kazmir out.